have a little lunch. Stop on a bridge. Bridges are good places to pull over. Just get you off the road. You can lean your bicycle up against the bridge. And this one's really quiet. This is this little muddy creek bed. Something like this banana peel. And uh, it's a pretty cool spot. Got some uh, big rice crispy treat. Uh, I think I got this at uh, that little convenience store at French Camp a couple days ago. Chocolate Rice Krispie Treats. Oh yeah. So if you're really desperate, get down one of one of these bridges underneath and sleep at night, camp out. I much prefer a real campground, but I'll tell you, there's some stretches along here. You can't make 70 miles. You're going to be rough camping somewhere, just sneaking off in the woods where nobody can see you or, or under a bridge or something. Um, some pretty long stretches out here. And some long stretches without water. I've been fortunate to have people give me water on three occasions when I was about out. <clears throat> I had a couple back a few miles ago trying to take a picture of a raccoon in a tree in Mississippi. And uh, but they were nice people. And I, I mentioned I was low on water, so they had a big pitcher of iced tea and they poured a bunch of it in one of my bottles, which I just drank for lunch, so it was good. So anyway, that's it. I'm uh, taking a, breath, a break. It's um, Tomorrow will be my last riding day. It'll be a pretty big day. I've, I've got to make 55 miles to finish tomorrow because I'm staying at mile marker 55 tonight, camping out. It'll be my last night camping. I've had a good mix of hotels and camping. And, um, Kind of sorry it's coming to a close, but got to go home sometime, right? I miss the family. I miss Denise, obviously. I miss the grandkids and the kids. And, um, I could see how if somebody had nobody, no family, they, they could get used to this life. And, um, you know, I, if that were the case with me, I think I'd just resupply myself in Natchez and keep riding, maybe on back to Florida. But, um, looking forward to seeing everybody and getting home and, and getting some work done. And, uh, been a great vacation.